What's up guys, this is The Mexican and I'm back with another fresh drinks review for you today. Um, today we're going to be doing the Godfather Legendary Premium Strong Beer. Uh, they do two types of these um, that I saw. I haven't really looked into it. They might do other types, but um, they, 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 I was at the um, the, the, the um, liquor stacks, it was called, with an X. Um, I was about to say supermarket, but that's not quite right. Liquor store, I guess, is most accurate. Um, and I, I went and asked, um, oh, hey, uh, what the two di what's the difference between these two? But the, the, the attendant was not all that helpful. Um, so, yeah, I don't, I don't really know, like, what the difference is so make sure you get the one if you want if you want to try the products i've got here make sure you grab the one that looks like this because that they, they looks pretty much exactly the same they both said some of the same stuff but they had two different like can designs um i don't believe they're the same product i just don't buy it um but, but they're both eight percent alcohol as well which is you make made it a bit hard for me to tell um at any rate like i said eight percent alcohol um i bought a four pack of uh 500 mil cans check that um I thought it was somewhere 500. Let's just assume it's 500 mils. It looks like a 500 mil big boy. I swear I saw that somewhere. Yeah, there it is inside. Yeah, uh, for, so, yeah, $16 for four 500 mil big boys. So that's not too bad, um, especially at 8% alcohol. So let's get into it. There we go. That was a bit of a. That was a bit of. That was a bit of a strong. Yeah, I was, I was pretty surprised by that. For some reason, I haven't grabbed the classic Stella Artois glass. I don't know why I've done that. There we go. Got ourselves a nice, nice, hate, nice, nice golden color here. That's 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 really really appealing actually. Let's give it a smell. I'm kind of getting um, uh, Carlsberg vibes, and a bit maybe a bit of VB. Um, you know, you you know that smell when you walk into one of those classic shit Australian pubs, and yeah yeah yeah, you just smell that beer when you go near the counter. That's what this smells like. Uh, not entirely appealing, but not unappealing either after a hard, hard day at work and you're craving a beer. So we'll, 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 let's, let's, let's have another sniff and get right into it. Yeah, no. Nah. Yeah, no, nah, just a bit of sweetness, I reckon. You can taste the alcohol in that. You can really taste that. That's it, it's, it's like they've thrown a bit of vodka in the back of it. Um... I'll try for, I, I meant to say, I don't know which country this comes from. I was, I was looking. Um, it's apparently it's 2.8 standard drinks also. I should probably mention that. Because um, the, the website is 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 support at devons.co.in. It's India. It's India. It's, it's an Indian beer, this, actually. That's right. I, I found it. I, I, it, said, it said it on the side. Um, uh, a bit, yeah, a, a bit out off to the side. Yeah, so an Indian beer. Um, yeah, the Godfather. I don't really know what that has to do with India, but there you go. Uh, they they make a they, they they make a beer that definitely tastes like alcohol, but still eight percent is a big boy. Still, it's not bad. It's definitely drinkable. Um, I wouldn't be I wouldn't be drinking this all night though. It's you you one you get fucked up, and two you can definitely you can definitely taste the alcohol in that. So you, you, it feels heavy, if you know what I mean. Um, like you're and somehow in terms of texture it it, it weighs the, the the palette down somehow um still it's drinkable and for 16 bucks if you're looking to get smashed on the four pack this this might be the ticket for you um especially a beer um second probably only to the carlsberg elephants really um which are also which are quite a nice beer in fairness to them i, I don't mind them um if you see if you can get them on special they're pretty good um but uh yeah no um yeah 16 bucks uh what i give this out of 10 um i give it I'll give it, I'll give it, I'll give it, I'll give it seven um, Godfathers out of ten legendary premium strong beers. Um, it's not, it's, yeah, it's, it's, it's not higher because you can definitely taste that alcohol on the back um, and you just can't drink it all night. Um, but it's got a pretty decent rating because it is high in alcohol and uh, pretty cheap. So, you know, and it does taste like beer. Um, a shit beer, but a beer on the same. So it's not, it's not too offensive. Um, if you like the content, go ahead and uh, smash that subscribe button. If you want to watch another video, go ahead and uh, click that button right there. It'll be another beer video. Once again, guys, this is The Mexican signing off.